What is going on guys and in this video I'm going to be showing you the fastest way to get to the Lendo Catacombs and well to be honest this is pretty hidden compared to the other ones I have found in the game and a lot of them are normally like off the cliff's edge or like required to open with like stones words keys. No this one's literally under the entire Royal Capital area and it can easily be missed as well but do keep in mind you can access this entire area as well including the subterranean shunning grounds after getting way farther into the game at the Lendo Capital of Ash version of this area as well. Nonetheless, the first thing you guys have to do to get to the catacombs is to first find these subterranean shunning grounds, which is going to be pretty hidden as well, but luckily it's not hard to get to. So the first thing you have to do is spawn over to the Avenue Balcony side of Grace, and I'll show you guys the fastest way to get there right now. Now that you guys have made it to the underground roadside side of Grace, getting to the Lendo Catacombs from here is honestly pretty easy. The most annoying part is going to be the huge lobsters. For some reason, they do an insane amount of damage, so watch out for them. So like the other catacombs, the first thing you'll have to do in this one is to find a device that actually opens the door into the boss room, which the boss in here is going to be Esgar, the Priest of Blood, which is actually going to be a pretty easy fight overall. Could be kind of tough depending on your level, but taking him down will get you the Lord of Blood's Exaltation, which what this does actually is blood loss in vicinity, increased attack power, which depending on your guys' build, this could be insanely good to use. So I'm going to show you guys the fastest way to the device first, and then right after that, the boss fight. Let's jump into it. <laughs> 